so welcome all the nams to swagatham my lovely people i hope you guys are doing absolutely fine and i welcome you all back to my channel Uh, so as in my intro video i told that this this video is going to be completely about the ride that i want to do uh, i did on the uh, on on the weekend yes last saturday we went to the one of the most historical places the ruins of south india hampi so hampi was like uh, it was like a very uh, you know rich empire in, the, in those centuries it was like asia second most richest empire and all and after few years what happened is after this muslim sultanates came and conquered the whole city they were like they made it completely into ruins first it was like full greenery and wealth and now it is like full brown wherever you go in hampi the only thing you can find is uh, 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 brown color buildings and very 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 hard hitting sunlight so whenever you go to hampi just remember carry a hat and a sunglasses without fail don't do the same mistake as i did because you will definitely get tanned if you go there so that was absolutely right about hampi because uh, wherever you go in hampi one common thing you find is that uh, there is a lot of brown color buildings everywhere i accept that in the olden days it was like full green and beautiful and the empire was wonderful but now it feels really hard to see all those greenery gone and full of brown everywhere and hard hitting sunlight everywhere so it is a bit of difficult to see but still this is also a kind of you know good experience because uh, the old old empires cultures and things are maintained so well that uh, it feels so fresh in yes after the muslim muslim sultanates came and conquered they had completely changed everything and they had become so cruel that they like they didn't destroy the whole monument the whole temple or the whole building is not destroyed what they have done is they destroyed only few parts of it for example if it is a temple then they have, they have just removed the face of the god or they have they have taken down two three pillars or taken down few sculptures so they have they have destroyed it in such a way that it looks odd but this is also a kind of beauty because of the uh, old things maintained so well that is why a lot of crowd huge amount of crowd all over the world comes if you go there you you will tell to see that more than the indians half of them are foreigners only and also you will find a lot of guides there <laughs> everything will be fun because there are few guides there are few guides who, who are very good at it but there are also few people who try to talk in that english accent and <laughs> tell everything was <laughs> Uh, it was it was okay okay to the foreigners just to make them believe that they're telling it in a good way so they just they just have that accent of that american accent yes so overall the whole experience was really well and really enjoyed uh, the whole 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 experience so in this vlog you guys are going to see mostly uh, the ride we did from uh, bangalore to hampi and what and all we saw so hope you and uh, also hampi is not such a big place to explore uh, it is just a small place so you just need maybe two days uh one day to explore there is a tungabhadra river in the middle and one day to explore the old ruins of uh, hampi and the other other day to explore the left hand side called as hippy island so in the hippy island uh, mostly it is about new new cafes around you know new place to enjoy and hang out with friends and all so and the right side is completely about old ruins old buildings and everything so since we were like we had an 8 hours of ride and we had only two days holiday so we didn't have time to explore the hippy island but we just heard about it from the owners of our uh, accommodation and all but uh, yes it is a good place to maybe you can we can plan a two day weekend yeah, just, you can you can obviously go there since we had to ride so long we didn't we didn't explore it so maybe next time we'll do it so hampi is a good place to explore a weekend get away place and you can have fun i apologize for not vlogging like this in the whole trip and you know i know this is not going to be a vlog this is actually will be termed as a video our journey video so hope you guys enjoy the video and uh, next trip next trip i'll definitely make sure that i take up the camera like this and vlog so hashtag humping to humpy starts right now please enjoy the video and uh, please subscribe to the channel if you guys are new and uh, please like if you like it so and keep supporting me so humping to humpy starts here Welcome back to my channel, my lovely people. I hope you guys are doing absolutely fine. So the time is two uh, forty-four in the morning, and we are all set to leave. So my friend is waiting over there. So let's go. Take him up. Let's start. 
humping to humping. Okay, meet you guys in some time. Let's rock and roll. Karapati Guppa, Moria. It's so beautiful, you and me. We meant to be in the great outdoors. Yeah. So, gadi gadi yon se nikalte hue. We are going. To the main road. We are actually going via nice road to Mukur. That is the road for us today. My friend is uh, waiting over there. He has been calling me since uh, 30 minutes. See, the problem is getting up is easy. After that, this uh, luggage loading is one hell of a uh, problem here. Yeah? Even I'm not sure whether my luggage is full intact. No. I'll just handle it and hope so there's no problem occurring. Yes, since I don't have a split seat, it's a small problem. Because the luggage tends to move forward when I break up. But yes, hopefully there shouldn't be any delays. Just a more. And we have all set roll! Oh, sorry, dire, dire, chala, dire, ha. Forever free. Guys, I know I know that this camera is not doing any justice now because since it is night and uh, there is a small problem in the uh, night version of this camera. So, I need you guys to when some light appears or something interesting appears. Okay? Okay. Oh, okay. See ya. The world seems small. We can sit together. It's so beautiful, you and me. We meant to be. Hey guys. Uh, sorry for the wind noise because my mic. There's no mic for me, so I'm just using normally. Uh, we have crossed about 40, 45 kilometers. The nice road is over. Now we are on our way to Tumkur. So I hope we'll, we'll do a small stop at Tumkuru. So yes, I've thrown some light here. That is the reason I just switched down my camera. I'll meet you guys in some time when we stop for uh, uh, stop for some breakfast or something. No, chai or something because there's nothing of interesting to show other than the empty old roads. Uh, temperature is quite nice. It's about 24 degrees Celsius and uh, yes, we're having a nice time. ಶ್ರೀಹಾದಿ He is, he is going to be my partner for the whole ride. Around uh, 70 kilometers from Bangalore. The time is uh, 4.17. Hoping to reach Hampi by uh, 10, 10, 10, 10, 30. Yes, everything is going fine till now. And the bikes are also performing good. Hope we reach safe and sound. So I'll meet you guys when you stop for breakfast. Hello, bye bye. We stopped in this place called uh, Sri Satya Hotel. Yeah, the tea was good, but uh, the vada is ultimately bakwas, so do not try. So, I will give you some time.
like a bird on a tree. I'm just sitting here. I got time. It's clear to see from up here. The world seems. Good morning, people. Very good morning. You are all watching this. I hope you guys are having fun. I'm having a lot of fun today. Uh, the time is around uh, 6 15, and yes, 200 kilometers done, more 180 kilometers to go. Hoping to reach by around uh, 10 10 15. Yes, we are near Kiryu. Our next stop is going to be Chitra Durga because uh, we need to have breakfast. I don't know why we are already hungry. Oh, it's getting brighter now. Let's do this. Oh. Take a step back to see the truth around you. From a distance, you can tell. bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time it's clear to see from up here the world seems small we can sit together it's so beautiful, you and me, we meant to be, in the great outdoors, forever free. Step back to see the truth. Of
like a bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see From up here The world seems small We can sit together It's so beautiful You and me We meant to be In the great outdoors Forever free That was our whole ride experience from the time we started uh, in Bangalore till we reached uh, Hampi. Uh, that was one beautiful of a ride because the things we saw while we were riding, like it still, it still, uh, it still gives me you know, those awesome feeling. That is the reason I wanted you, I wanted you guys to see all those. That is the reason this video has been so long. You know that beautiful feeling when you see those wonderful roads, those lakes, those tunnels, and you know all that. All that experience was really good, and the windmills. So I've tried my maximum to show it to you guys and I hope you get that vibe and feeling that we had when we were riding. Uh, that is the reason the video has been so long. I thought that I will complete this video in uh, one single vlog but uh, the whole humpy video but I don't think that is working. So I'm going to release this in around, uh, uh, around two, two parts. So one part is going to be this. Uh, the next part will come up tomorrow which is going to be nothing but uh, what all we did in humpy and the return journey. Uh, obviously in the return journey I will not show you much of the roads because this is the same road that we uh, took while going so it's gonna be the same road while coming back so I just showing most some interesting parts and also uh, and the places we visited in Hampi and a few beautiful uh, time lapses that I captured uh, so I hope you guys uh, love the video you know I, I don't think I did a wonderful job in this but yes as a first first time vlogger you know I think I did a decent job and I hope you guys appreciate it so if you, if you guys think that I did uh, a decent job so please Hit the like button below and also the subscribe button. So, uh, so please keep supporting me and I hope you like you guys uh, are starting to love me and you know like my videos. So until tomorrow, it's Vishal signing off. Live your dreams, love your life. Bye bye. See you tomorrow.